Coming up on this episode of Juliana and Bill. Did I tell you I'm going to Maryland? No, I didn't know. Do you know how much stuff we have to do? I want to be a good daughter, a good sister, and on top of everything, a good presenter. That's like the whole reason I'm going to Maryland. Oh, There's baby. no prompter. No. Oh my gosh, the Domino's Pizza, honey. I used to work there. Mama, papa. It's going to be all a bunch of Italians who don't speak English. Si, si, tutto bene, si. tutto bene. So I decide to hire an Italian tutor. Eh, la vostra casa. No, Bill, you are not listening to me. I'm going to make a little toast in Italian. I love the way you are. How's work going? It's good. Yeah? Crazy busy. And on top of everything, I'm going to Maryland. Oh, you are? Did I waiting? tell you I'm going to Maryland? No, I didn't know. Yeah, I have to go to an event at University of Maryland. Oh, really? I haven't been to my school in, literally since I graduated. You graduated. And so I'm going to get up and present awards to a few people. Have you guys been back since you've been married? No. You haven't been back? Did you prep him for it? Oh, my God. I was born in Italy, but you know, I grew up in, in Maryland, and I have 40 first cousins. A lot of them live in Maryland. That's a lot of aunts, uncles, nephews, nieces, cousins, a lot of Italians to hang out with. Basically, we're only there for 48 hours, which is not enough time. All we're gonna be doing is eating the whole time. And translating. It's gonna be all a bunch of Italians who don't speak English. That's where Bill. <laughs> My first thing I say is, good evening, I'm Juliana Rancic, and I'm delighted to present the first award of the evening. And then so I get into a whole thing. This is a pretty formal script. Of, uh... See, I thought it was more loosey-goosey because it's University of Maryland. Going back to University of Maryland is just a huge deal for me because my professors are going to be sitting there, and one of them gave me a B- in broadcast delivery. And if I mess up a word, he's going to be like, she deserved it. So I was thinking of pulling out my secret weapon. What is your secret weapon? Ryan Seacrest jokes. That is a death march. What are you talking about? It's a black tie event. It's a way to kind of like loosen the room up. I'm telling you, have you ever been to something that I've spoken to when I've oh, started I with the Ryan Seacrest yes, joke? I have. Ryan Seacrest and I work together every day hosting E! News, and so he knows I actually do Seacrest jokes sometimes, and he thinks it's totally funny. Hello. First of all, I just want to thank my co-host on E! News, Ryan Seacrest, for not coming tonight, because I can wear my heels. No, I mean, I, I think it's it's it could be funny for the right audience. Funny, Simon Cowell does it. Yeah, Randy Jackson, different. the that's dog. Different. I mean, even Paula makes fun of him. She's like barely breathing. And she finds the strength. You come off more intelligent if you tell a better joke. I, I don't know. Maybe. What? And I mean, they know what I do isn't like hard hitting journalism. Maybe I'm like I'm hired to be the comedic relief. I'm funny. Family is everything to me. Well, I think I think one of the major hurdles that I've had is the, is the language barrier. It certainly impeded my progress in getting into the family. So I decide to hire an Italian tutor. Hopefully, by me learning Italian, I'll be in the circle of trust. Hey, okay. We Italians morally try to avoid, and you should continue to avoid, the brutta figura, bad impression, ah, poor impression. See, see, see. What you have to try to accomplish is bella figura. Bella good, figura. A good impression. Who do you kiss? You know, guys are kissing guys. I mean, you go with the flow. So if I stand up this. So, hey, hey, ciao, hey, come ciao. Ciao. Come on. Come on. OK. Bravo, bella figura. Grazie. OK, I'm going to continuiamo con la lezione. Mm -hmm. We're going to have a dinner at his brother's house. Many of them don't even speak a word of English. Mm -hmm. If I can get up and make a toast, I think it'll win some of them over. Definitely. You want to thank them? Just a, you know, just a toast. No. Pleasure to, you no. know. No. I want to thank them. OK, bravo. Let's make sure that you know how to pronounce things properly. See. You don't want to make brutta figura. Mille grazie. Thanks a million. Eh, no, mille means a thousand, but close enough. Invitato alla vostra casa, in your house, and your family. Mille grazie a tutto di avermi invitato alla vostra 
casa y la vostra familia. Okay, yes, but this is not e. E. They'll think you said e. No, you said e. Said e. No. Invitato. No. E la vostra casa. No, Bill, you are not listening to me. Why are you busting my balls? Però in italiano. Breaking my balls. Okay, no, not pointing. They are heavy. <laughs> vale, okay. You hate me now, but you're gonna love me later. Perfecto. Bravo. Hey, kid. Hey, Boo Boo. How are you holding up? Okay. Yeah? Do you know how much stuff we have to do? In 48 hours? Just break this down. We know we've got to do the presentation, so let's get that off the table. I just feel so overwhelmed. I want to be a good daughter, a good aunt, a good sister, a good wife. It's like all these things in this amount of time. Oh, and on top of everything, a good presenter. That's like the whole reason I'm going to Maryland. I just... The worst thing you can do right now is freak out. I feel the pressure. Yeah, you, know? you feel the pressure. Well, now that I'm part of the family, hopefully gonna win them over with some of my Italian. They're heavy, <laughs> huh? <laughs> Who is this guy? Yeah, this guy's a character. It'd be like, like this. Yeah. No, it's yeah. like you're holding your balls. This is, this what, is what he told me. It ain't like this. This is like, gang, what's up, what's this up? Guy didn't know what he's talking Honey, about. please don't throw out gang signs to my parents, please. The balls you can do, the gang signs, not so much. Where I grew up is really important to me, and Bill hasn't spent much time in Maryland with my family. Yeah, it's very important that they mesh properly. I'm excited to try out my Italian. Oh, you gotta do that, honey. I'm excited to hear it. Mama, Babo! Oui. Oui. How are you? Good. Come on, you're doing well. Yeah, bene, bene. Pasquale, come stai? Hey, so come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> now, I am learning Italian, however, when they talk that fast, I can't understand a word. No, they were saying uh, you look great. Oh, good. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. English. There's a lot of drama involved with going home to see my family because I want to be able to see everyone in a short amount of time. And to make matters even worse, I have a presentation to give at my alma mater. You know, my goal is to win over the family. Sono molto fortunato di... <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, hey. So I want to give a toast at the family dinner. Oh. In Italian. Can I see? Now, are you going to use these cards for the toast? Oh, no. That would not be acceptable. So you have to remember this whole thing for the toast? Yes, I am. All right, let's practice. <clears throat> mi scusi, mi scusi. Oh. Uh, uh, mi, uh... Sono molto fortunato. Sono molto fortunato. Di? Di? Invitato? No. Essere? Essere. Invitato? No. Uh, to familia no. e casa? No. no, no, no. Brutta figura. Brutta figura. Let me look at this one. Don't you have to be working on your speech? Bottom line, the key to a good presentation is you've got to prepare. You've got to prepare, prepare, prepare. I say bottom line is prompter, prompter, prompter. You prepare, prepare, prepare. I'll prompter, prompter, prompter. Let and me know how it goes. Oh, it's going to go great. You know what? I'm going to go hang out with my niece. Mm. Yeah, little auntie niece time. How's your homework? It's hard. Well, I can help you. What is it? It's algebra. Oh, algebra? You don't have like uh, English homework or anything? No. Uh -huh. Two. M over M plus 4 equals 3 over M minus 1. You know what? Do you have makeup? Okay, first we'll do a little blush. This is good. I gotta say, I'm working on that speech, you know? And then, like, you know, it's a very serious crowd. But I'm not that serious. But Bill doesn't think I should do jokes. Why not? 
I don't know. I guess he thinks my jokes aren't that funny. I disagree completely. See, isn't this more fun than algebra? Much. She is gonna kill you for showing me these pictures. What are you guys doing? Ooh. Hey! hey. <laughs> So I get home from hanging out with Olivia, my niece, and I catch Bill looking at old, ugly pictures of me with my mom. Oh my God, honey, I don't want to see you to see these. I'm like, look how scary I look. I really never wanted to show you my Bon Jovi hair. You give love a bad name. I do. I do give love a bad name. Let me see. Girl, Look at this cool. dude. I mean, imagine that guy walking around in his speedo. That's posh. <laughs> you got to be kidding me. Oh my God. Look at you. What? You were naked. I was not 15. naked. Okay, you were top. No, no, no. Europeans were different. Would you ever have fallen in love with this face? Absolutely. You have to look into the past to see the future. To see how ugly our kids are going to be. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't cute. This is unreal. You get to see the upstairs, honey. You have to put a ring on my finger to come up here. I know. The last time I was at her parents' house, I was forbidden to go upstairs. Italian fathers do not allow strange men <sighs> to go into their daughter's bedroom. What does he think I was going to do? You could have your way with me. He had no idea. Huh. That was too late for that. What? Rancic. Here it is. Oh, my goodness. It's pink. Huh. What do you think of it? Uh, it's interesting. <laughs> it's a little bad. Oh my god, I haven't been in my bed in forever. Lay down, honey. <sighs> it's a little tight. <laughs> well, I couldn't even bring you up here while we were engaged. I know. <laughs> I had to we wait to wait till we were married. Isn't that crazy? That's funny. I should fool around. Here. What? <laughs> Are you crazy? Give me a little something. Get out of here. <laughs> no way, man. I've never had a boy in my room. Well, guess what? What? That nothing's happening up here. I don't need uh, Eduardo to come up here with his pistola. <laughs> that doesn't make you want to hook up with me in our bedroom? No. You're so boring, honey. That's right. Mwah. But I'm alive. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good thing. I wanted to just mention something before you meet the guys. Try not to embarrass me. Yeah. Don't embarrass Seriously. such a pandy name. Yeah. All it's right. called raw athleticism. I just It's a term you're probably not familiar with. My brother-in-law, Posh, is a tough nut. I think I still have some proving to do to him. Well, I'm his baby sister, that's why. So he's very protective of me. But my brother's best. He actually reminds me a lot of Bill. Except I have hair. You do have more hair than my brother, but don't let him hear you say that. Well, he's, you know, really... he's not aware of the fact that he's bald? Come on. He's not bald. He's bald -ing. He's bald. He's balding. He's not bald. OK. If you <laughs> seem to be in trouble, I'll come and I don't need no. I'm good. All right. I'll be bailing you out, pal. You might have to. Here we go with the excuses again. All right, make me proud, honey. I like this guy. <laughs> Jump. Kick him in the nuts. Really, pick somebody up, anybody. All right, somebody tall. I'll get this guy here. My brother's like an amazing soccer he's player. He's good looking, he has hair, he he's an amazing he's soccer six, player. He's very athletic and he's 6'4", <sighs> so he is very tall and towers over a lot of the other and athletes. And bald. <gasps> Ma! Hi! Como esta? Bene! Dile bravo! Hi! Hi, Hi Mom! Good. How do you Billy doing? Um, is it school? He's okay. <laughs> no, no score. <laughs> Good job, honey. Yes! Woo! Good job, baby. Oh, you did good. You did good, honey. Right. Come on, baby. My mom brought you some uh, post-game okay, okay. snacks. <laughs> oh, my God. That was just normal? You do this up? Yeah. Actually, yeah, we, have, we actually have... We, a te ti piace la pasta, no? Usually have bigger bowls. Mille le piace la pasta. Lasciate lo stare. So you kind of... Va bene adesso? That's for Posh. I can't eat that. No, one. that's you. That's you. No, no, yeah. hey. no, no. Honey, no. please don't offend my mother and, and eat the pasta. It is good. Okay. Hey, man, you kept position today. I liked it. I liked it. You stayed in your place. You know what? Come and visit more often. I'll take you out here more often. I'd love to, actually. Yeah. Old hood.
Hollywood, baby. That's the 7-Eleven where I used to hang out. Really? Yes. Gosh. That's my old school. This is a beautiful high school. Oh, Jerome and Marco Stadium. That was my principal when I went here. I'm glad we're doing this. Yeah, this is fun. It gives me a little uh, view into your past. Oh my gosh, the Domino's Pizza, honey. I used to work there. Funny. Let's go in. Hi, welcome Hi. to Congress. How are you doing? I used to work here. Oh, really? Yeah, so I wanted to show my husband. That's cool. I'm shocked that she was actually making pizzas at Domino's because based on the way she cooks today, you'd never know she had any skills in the kitchen. Oh, <laughs> well. Oh, my God. Do you like it, honey? You look good. Thank you for calling Domino's Pizza. Are you going to take my order? Yes. What would you like to order, my love? Thank you for calling Domino's Pizza. This is Juliana. Would you like to try our new bacon double cheeseburger feast pizza? Oh, what's on it? It is delicious. It is bacon and cheese and uh, meat. And it's a feast. Absolutely, you can get veggies. We have lots of veggies. Green you pepper. like green pepper? Very healthy. It goes right through hot you. Hot banana pepper. Oh, and we have hot banana pepper. Talk about going through you. Yeah, no, if you have indigestion, that's not good. Two pizzas, one for Bill and one for the dude who called. <sighs> this is Bill's. This will be Bill's. What the hell is this thing? This I don't remember. That's it? Is this right? I got a tan over here. Don't look. Don't look. Oh my God, honey. What? It looks like a heart. I made it. Hard. Like a human heart. It's with love. Try it. It's <laughs> good. Mm, you did good, kid. Thank you. Oh, and that dude's pizza's over there. It just needs to be sliced. But okay. It looks real good. All right. I gotta say, this trip has been great. We've done a lot more than I expected, but we do still have one big thing to do. All right, joke or no joke? Just a little one. Do you think I'm funny? Am I funny or not? Okay, so we're gonna get started. Okay. Um, here are your cards with your talking points for the awardees. Great, and can you um, just tell the prompter guy, I usually go a little slower, so maybe if he wants to just slow it down a little bit, that'd be great. Kinda old school, no prompter, just cards. Sorry, no rope, there's baby. no prompter. No. Rope, there's baby. no prompter. They're gonna love you. Joke or no joke? Just a little one. Please join us in welcoming Juliana Nixon. This is exciting. Good evening, everyone. Very excited to be here. Uh, Gosh, I'm a little nervous. I don't know why coming back to my alma mater is making me nervous. We're gonna be thanking a lot of people tonight. And first and foremost, I would like to thank my co-anchor, Ryan Seacrest on E! News for not being here tonight, because I get to wear my heels. And I love that. Anyway, good evening once again. I'm Juliana Rancic, and I am really delighted to present the first award of the evening. Thank you, baby. Was it okay? It's perfect. I did the Seacrest joke. I was great. Did it work? Oh my god, it was a hit. Okay, good. Yeah, it was funnier than funnier than you expected. I told you, honey. It's funnier than you expected. A lot funnier. All right, you hungry? I'm starving. Mama's lasagna. Mama the Mama's lasagna. So we come back from the big event, and my mom had invited more people than I expected to my brother's house for the dinner. She invited all these people that I didn't think I was gonna be able to see, like my uncles and cousins, and it was such a nice surprise. I would say the pressure is definitely now on that I deliver the speech perfectly. Perfetto. Did you say perfecto? Perfetto. Yes, good, no yeah. see, bravo, bella figura. Bella figura. I'm gonna make a little toast. I recently started taking Italian lessons with an Italian tutor. Oh, thank you. 
Thank you, thank you. So, I want to do a little toast. Italia. In Italia. Mille grazie a tutti di avermi invitato alla vostra casa e la vostra famiglia. Sono molto fortunato di essere parte della vostra famiglia e di avere Giuliana come mia mole. Moglie. It was wonderful. I got up, I gave the speech. You called me a mole. Moglie. Wow. See? Moglie. Moglie. Yeah. I'm now in the circle of trust. Yes. This mole loved it. On the next episode of Juliana and Bill. All right, Bill's getting his pilot license. So do you want to go up or not? I don't know if I can do it. I have to get rid of my fear of flying. We should do these treatments, hypnosis. Aromatherapy. Acupuncture. OK. I'm going to go right between your eyebrows. I'm not doing it. Yes, you are. We're going to die up here. Ah!